Brendan, one one draw here uh, at Brentford. Does that feel like a very important point? Yeah, I think that uh, it certainly breaks the cycle that we were on, and uh, I think we deserved it. It's shown to be a really tough place to come uh, this season. So, uh, for many teams, have suffered here, but uh, but I thought the players were were really good. We're unfortunate with the goal we gave away, um, but other than that, we defend it really well. Had to defend lots of set pieces, lots of throw-ins, lots of variety in terms of free kicks and everything, but. We stood up to that really, really well. Um, and then obviously it was just a case of just finding the, the, the moments of quality. And we did that in the second half and scored a fantastic goal. So, uh, but yeah, concentration was really good in the game. Focus was good. And uh, and it looked as the, the second half wore on that maybe we could find a winner, but just couldn't quite manage that. And if anyone was questioning the heart of the players, did that second half performance in particular show exactly where this group is at, at the moment. Yeah, yeah. Listen, for for what we'll lack in quality at times, we we have a real honesty and a spirit in the in the group, and I think we've seen that uh, today. And you need that if you're going to come to a place like Brentford and, and get a point after the season they're having. Then uh, then of course we uh, you need to have that spirit and that resilience. And uh, you now we had that in bundles today. And scored a, a fantastic goal from mm. Kieran and Drewsby Hall through to James Madison and, yeah. and then the finish from Harvey as well. Yeah, yeah, sure. Great tenacity. We were pressing was good. Got in and around the ball in numbers. He won it back. He's made a great pass to James and then James is in the perfect position for him. Great assist and Barnsley finishes it superb. So, uh, so yeah, yeah, really good goal. Danny Leverson, you handed him his, his first start mm. in the league. Um, how did you think he did and how hard a decision was that in terms of personnel in goal today? Yeah, it was very difficult because you, um, you know, I, I wanted to give Danny a chance. He's been a really loyal number two here, Danny Ward, and uh, I felt he deserved the chance uh, to come in and, and stick a claim. But time's running out. You know, the games there's only twelve games to go, and I felt that, you know, by making a change to see what can can make a difference. I had a really honest chat with with Danny during the week, and um, and he was great about it. He understands that maybe he hasn't uh, played to the level that he wanted to and he understood my decision. So um, I thought both keepers today didn't have a great deal to do, to be honest. And But what Daniel did, he did really well. And just finally, international break now um, and then a huge game at, at Selhurst Park straight yeah. after it. Um, is anyone that missed today potentially going to be back for that? I'm thinking of Johnny Evans and, and some others as well who are currently on the injury list. Yeah, well, we're hoping that some of those boys won't be too far away. Uh, like I said, Victor Christensen should be hopefully back in and Yuri Tillmans will hopefully train um, in the second week of the international break. Uh, hopefully Johnny will be fine as well. So, um, but yeah, we'll just uh, we'll assess that. Obviously, White Vass will be back, uh, which will be good news. So, um, so, yeah, we should be healthier going into our next game.